Back to in-person school for some Southern Arizona students today, Vail debuted its hybrid learning model across the district. News 4 Tucson's Austin Walker joining us live in Vail right now. And Austin, what are parents saying about their kids going back inside the, the schools? John, all day parents have been pretty happy about getting their kids out of the home and back into the classroom. Now, the district has plans in place for COVID-19, and parents also say today has been a special one. Some are comparing it to a holiday. Today feels like Christmas has finally come. It feels so exciting. Or even to the happiest day of your life. Um, but getting to this point, it's kind of like planning a wedding. Allison Pratt has a fourth grader at Esmond Station in Vail and says there were some jitters last night. The funny thing is yesterday I was like, okay, we have to lay out our clothes. Don't forget your mask. Um, it's just kind of a funny, it feels normal, but yet it feels strange too. You know, But just... cold feet were definitely not a thing. He was so excited to see his teacher, the other adults on campus that he loves and then being able to see his friends. And as the school bell sounds and students walk down the halls with masks in hand, the classrooms look a little different. Dividers are placed around all desks and chairs are socially distanced. But like your wedding day, there's always bumps in the road. Darcy Mentone, the spokesperson for Vail School District, says planning this day has been challenging. The biggest hurdle is that there isn't a one size fits all answer for anything. Vail is offering two plans, a hybrid model, which is a mixture of in person and online instruction and also a completely online option. For Pratt, she says she still has questions. You know, it's funny, I actually already emailed my um, son's teacher and just said, I feel like a new kinder parent just thinking, okay, what are they doing right now? And how's lunch going and how's recess going? And for the district, they say they do have the best interest at heart for their students. We're hoping for another great day like today. And while the kids aren't throwing rice at lunch or toasting on the playground, the consensus is they're pretty happy to be back in person. Now, for a full list of what Vail is doing for that reopening process, that's on KVOA.com. We've got you covered here live from Vail. I'm Austin Walker, News 4, Tucson.